Hi Pisces, welcome to Heaven Healing in Tarot. This is Christina. Today we're going to be getting you some messages. Let's see what's going on in your energy and what your angels and guides would like to tell you at this time. Before I get started, I always send out some healing, so take a deep breath with me. You ready? All right, Pisces, let's get your cards. Seven of Cups, Nine of Swords, Three of Swords, The Star, Four of Wands. All right, Pisces. So it looks like you're going to have some opportunities here or some options, some choices, some something that you're going to have to make a choice. It kind of feels like a decision is going to have to be made. But you're afraid of this. You're afraid of this decision or you're afraid of making this um having this taking a chance I kind of feel like you're afraid to take a chance here because you've had some heartache in your life and this heartache is still sitting with you like things didn't work out for you in some aspect and it it still bothers you you're still holding on to it you're still losing sleep over it you're still getting angry over it at times but the stars here are saying that you will be getting a wish come true and that four of wands could be marriage here could be a new marriage or it could be just building a firm foundation with somebody or it just could be a reason to celebrate celebrating with friends so you're going to have a wish come true here I'm just not sure how how it's going to play out but there's something that like you're afraid to make a decision here because of of being hurt in the past so let's get some more cards and we'll see where this is going a little bit here but um yeah, it looks like you are really hesitating making a decision or choosing an option because of this heartache here. Oh, seven of cups again. Look at that. Judgment. The world heartache again so you got double cards here and double cards here sevens and threes all right so this is pretty powerful this means you really are having a hard time moving on from this heartache you're really having a hard time making a decision you have not let this heartache go you have not healed from it and the judgment cards tells me that you keep replaying it in your head over and over again, trying to figure out what went wrong or what you could have said or what you could have done differently, how, how you're going to do things differently in the future. Like you just are like, this is like a loop in your head here. It feels like it feels like you're not able to let it go. You're not able to move on. What I want to tell you, Pisces, is that you have the world at your feet right now. That cycle is coming to an end. Okay, that heartache is over. It's done. We have to let it go. We have to move on from it. You have the star here and the four of wands, which is a bright future, which is having hope, being able to celebrate something, celebrating any little achievement that you might have. So let's get into that energy and let this heartache go already. It's not helping you. So the world is saying that this cycle is closing up. We have a new cycle beginning. Let's get ready for it. We have hope here. We're going to have a reason to celebrate. So let's get in that mindset. <coughs> Sorry. Starting fresh. A wonderful new beginning is blossoming in my life. Yeah. The world is bringing a new cycle. You're starting fresh. This cycle can be anything you want it to be. Let's let go of that heartache, okay? We need a fresh start here. Your desire is in with within reach have faith as everything is working in your favor 
So I told you you're going to have a reason to celebrate. Behind the scenes, everything's playing out for you. You just might not see it yet. So do what you got to do, Pisces. Do what you got to do and move on from this heartache already. This one, like, I know I'm being tough because heartache hurts. It hurts and it's hard to get over. I understand that. But I feel like you're at a point where, like, I just want to slap you. I just, and not that I want to be violent with you or anything, but I just want to shake some sense into you saying, it's done. It's time to move on. We're not fixing this. You replaying it in your head is doing nothing to help you recover from it. It's doing nothing from you to re- to move on from it. We've got to forgive ourselves for what we did wrong, our part in it, and and let it go. Let's move on. Tough love, Pisces. Tough love. Sorry about it. But sometimes when I'm feeling it, I got to say it. Right now, stay in the present and don't get too far ahead of the flow. You'll soon trust that nothing more will come than can be handled each moment. All right, so stop worrying about the future, basically is what they're saying. Stop worrying about the future. Live in the moment. Do what you need to do right now. If there's a decision you need to make right now, make it. We'll figure out the future when it comes. The future will figure itself out, really. Stop worrying about the future and let go of the past. Enlightenment. Pursue spiritual growth. All right. So what does that mean? It means there's certain things that we have to face. We need enlightenment on. So if you're still feeling this heartache, let's take a look at it. Let's figure out why. What caused us to feel this way? What did what what play what role did we play in it? Can we can we figure out why we 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 did what we did? And can we forgive it? Let's face it. Let's face it head on. Let's do some of this shadow work. Why? Because that's going to bring us enlightenment. That's going to be like, okay, now I understand. I understand why I feel heart heartbroken, what my role was in it, and why I did what I did. Why I played the role that I played. You know, why I did it. Now I understand. Now I have enlightenment. Now I can grow. Now I can let it go. Now I can move on. All that's important. But we got to you got to break things down step by step it's tedious it's sometimes you know painful we don't want to do it we don't want to face that we we were wrong in any way or that we caused harm in any way we don't want to face those things and i'm not saying you did any of that i'm just saying that there are things that's why we don't do shadow work that's why we can't move on from heartache so if we can do that you'll be able to let it go the energy is gaining momentum, so you're going to have to make a decision soon, it feels like. Like, something's going to be like, it's now or never, buddy. What are you going to do? That's what I'm getting. But something's going to be worth waiting for. So... You know, maybe you haven't found love yet. Maybe the, the right person's coming in now, but you have to choose to allow that person to come in, right? But it was going to be worth the wait. So your heartache, you'll understand why you went through the heartache. You'll have that light bulb moment. You'll have that enlightenment. Imagine all unwanted thoughts dissolving into light, creating room for new opportunities and possibilities for your life. So let's just visualize. Let's visualize all negative things going out the window, down the drain, away from us, right? Let's imagine that. And let's imagine only positive and great things are coming in for us. Let's feel it. What does that feel like when only positive and great things are coming in for us? What's that feel like? It feels good, right? Let's sit in that. Let's sit in that for a little bit. 
that'll help attract it to you. Your Dreams of Gaia tarot card is choice. Surprise, surprise. We got this whole, we got seven of cups twice. It's all about choice, making a decision. All right. Uh, let's see. Choice. Keywords, options, opportunity, cause and effect, procrastination, consequences, and reward. All that you are and all that you've learned and experienced is born of choice. The choices you have made, the choices others have made on your behalf, or the choices they have made for themselves that have impacted on or influenced your life. You may believe that you have no choice, but that in itself is a choice. You may also exercise your right to allow others to decide for you. This too is a choice. So in this moment exists an opportunity to create or transform your future. You stand at the crossroads. The past is behind you and the future lies ahead. Now is the time to take control of your life and determine the direction you wish to take. Be both mindful and responsible for the choices that you make in the present. Use this moment to take stock. Ask yourself if the decision you have before you is being overly influenced by your relationship with another. Are you choosing in order to make someone else happy? Or are you or to make yourself happy? Remember the choice is yours. Whether that choice involves taking a risk, allowing someone else to choose for you, or giving another's happiness and well-being more important than your own even if it's a choice to do nothing at all. You are being asked to make your decision with awareness that your choices define you and that you have real power. All right. So basically, Pisces, they want you to make a choice. They want you to decide. You're at a crossroads and your future's at stake here. So what are you going to do? I think it's up to you. Well, I don't think. I know it's up to you. We have free will here. Make the decision that's best for you, not anybody else. Put on your crown. Put on your crown. Sorry about the dog. Put on your crown. Find your power. All right? Your angel's here. They're here. There's angel wings. They're here. Right? You can lean on your friends if you have to. Help help you, like, use them as a sounding board. Right? Just don't wear a mask. Don't lie to yourself. Okay? Make sure you're being true to yourself. Make sure you're being honest with yourself. Don't And don't try and impress anybody. Be you. And then you have the doggy angel and the doll paw. So that makes me feel, kind of makes me feel like you've lost a pet recently. So if you have, I'm very sorry for your loss. And if it hasn't been too recent, then maybe your pet on the other side is coming back just to say hello just to say you know we feel your heartache and we're coming in to let you know that you're loved so all right Pisces that's what I got for you I'm going to end it because of the dogs (laughs) no I'm ending it because it's done there's nothing else for me to say so give the video like subscribe to the channel and leave me a comment all of those things help me greatly and I appreciate you for it Till next time, love and light.